Each year, from 2014 to 2016, broke the record of global air temperature. And 2017 was one of the hottest years ever. As we know, how hot a person perceives does not rely on air temperature alone. Other climatic factors, such as humidity and wind, also play important roles in the human perceived equivalent temperature, or called apparent temperature. In hot days, humidity brings surplus heat stress to human body. So a person feels hotter than air temperature when he is in a humid environment. For example, in summer, when we travel from a hot and humid region, like Hong Kong, to a hot but dry region, we usually feel less hot in the dry region. Even the air temperatures in the two regions are the same. When it is cold, a strong wind can make a person feel even colder, even though the air temperature itself does not decrease. As a matter of fact, under climate warming, not only air temperature increases, other climatic factors, such as humidity and wind speed, also change. Therefore, apparent temperature may change differently compared to air temperature. Scientists use analysis datasets, which assimilate observations and numerical models to represent the past and current climate, and employ global climate models to simulate and project future climate under different carbon emission scenarios in the 21st century. Our research team used four analysis datasets and outputs from seven GCMs to estimate the human perceived equivalent temperature from simulation of air temperature, humidity, and wind. We found that the analysis datasets and GCMs indicated that the global land average apparent temperature increased 0.04 degrees Celsius per decade, faster than air temperature before 2005. This trend was projected to increase to 0.06 degrees Celsius per decade and 0.17 degrees Celsius per decade under representative concentration pathway 4.5 scenarios and LCP 8.5 respectively and reduced to 0.02 degrees Celsius per decade under LCP 2.6. The faster increases in apparent temperature are more considerable in low latitude areas dominated by hot and humid climate than the middle and high latitude areas. The faster increase in human perceived equivalent temperature than air temperature is mainly due to the increase of air temperature, humidity, and relatively insignificant change of wind speed under global warming. The research findings provide us a better understanding of change in human perceived equivalent temperature under global warming. Based on the results, we can see that global warming has relatively stronger long-term impacts on apparent temperature than air temperature under both extreme and non-extreme weather conditions, suggesting that climate change adaptation should focus on heatwave events and also should be extended to the whole range of effects of temperature increases. Compared to air temperature, apparent temperature is a better indicator of thermal discomfort or stress of human which has direct impacts on human health, labor productivity, heat-related morbidity, and mortality. Our study of the faster increases in apparent temperature has produced important findings for this kind of climate change impact assessment, providing a strong scientific support for more stringent and effective mitigation efforts to combat global warming. Therefore, the world as perceived by human beings, is expected to become hotter than that just indicated by air temperature under global warming. Cities and regions, especially those located at tropical and subtropical regions, dominated by hot and humid climate like Hong Kong, will face bigger threats from hot weather, and therefore greater efforts for climate change mitigation are vital and urgent. <laughs>